Once upon a time, mm. I'm back. Um, it's episode eight of season five, and its title is Birth. So um, let's do it. Let's do it. He what? didn't even knock. I was thinking Damn the same it. thing. You tell me who that is. Whoa! Just <laughs> shoot through the table. I think you brought a hook through a sword fight. <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh, oh. Now kill him with it. Yes. That would have been best. Oh, 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 oh. Doesn't matter in the dark one. You're more than the dark Your one. Your voice is like different this episode only. Why do you need a scalabar? Nanya, business. <laughs> maybe she just has a cold. I know. Maybe she's just the dark one in her drafty basement. Gave her a little. <clears throat> I'm drinking my soda from Storybrooke. Oh, that's right. Maybe you've heard of it. It's Canada. <laughs> <laughs> what? What's happening? What's happening? Why is Granny's mm -hmm. key the same as the bed and breakfast key? Mm -hmm. Beverly, no. I'm sorry. Arthur has my family. Yes, because of me. I'm sorry. And, and also because of, you know, Zelina. Then we get our Emma back. Our Emma back! Gay! Crocodile, we need to talk. He has a name. She found it. Dark ones are clever like that. And you have the most obvious safe in the world. <laughs> Schizophrenia is a heck of a thing. Why do they have empty houses in Storybrook at all? I'd go live in it immediately. You just like this book as much as your mom. Ow. What's happening? What's happening? What's going on there? That's awesome. You gonna jump? You gonna jump, honey? Pirate in skinny jeans. Yeah, he's a pirate from Hot Topic. I need to know what happened between us and Camelot. Just tell me. It's not that easy. It can be. I will keep trying to kill myself until you tell me. I couldn't drink the captain's wine. I drowned him. That's hot. Who else you kill? He's lucky he has the same finger size of all the people he kills. I guess being the dark one has its perks. Being a peeping Tom? Anyone can do that. Um. She looks like Lady Gaga. She kiss a death him. She poison ivy him. Are you sure it was her? Just yes, the same with the dog when I was your onion rings. Oh, don't eat them! <laughs> Look how she's like, you ate onion rings with her? Yay! Got your hair bleached. What's with the dye job? Oh, so, so. Oh, they had to, like, they had to acknowledge. Because I zombie, you have to do it. You're gonna die. Your uterus should not stretch that quickly. Her guts are gonna fall out. <laughs> or they're gonna at least feel like they're falling out. <laughs> so, Doc, who should I execute first? Your boyfriend or your father? My father. I mean, no! Haha, <laughs> gotcha. I thought Regina's like, good one. <laughs> that big epic fight and you just knock her down a little bit. Isn't it like the moment he tries to do dark stuff, like to kill someone? Wouldn't he like no longer be light anymore? Oh, they getting her. Was I supposed to be worried? It's just Mary Margaret. If that was Regina, I'd be crying. Yeah, he even got a hand. Why are you chaining him up? Really glad that worked. <laughs> Otherwise, your mom would be dead. You can lie to your parents, you can lie to yourself. But you can't lie to me. Because they're bros for life. <laughs> I'm getting answers. That's enough. Okay, you know what? She was almost making it work. Y'all are stupid. See, now you scared her off. Like, the only good friend she has has tried to kill her like 80 times. It's a baby girl. Is it green? Baby! Mm -hmm. Baby! Zelina's just like, <laughs> it's hurting her. I like it. Yeah. Look who's green with envy now. Oh. Oh, that is so <laughs> what a jerk. I guess they are going to be nursing the baby. Yeah, the baby needs to eat. They kidnapped me right after giving birth. They separated me from my little girl. You probably need medical attention. I'm not taking Zelina's magic. I'm giving her mine instead. What? Why? Don't do that. Because I knew you would never let me do what was necessary to get the job. Are you gonna kill Zelina? Yes. The darkness needs to be contained in a vessel, you. Just put it in an iguana. What are you going to do? Like misfits. How about a pig? Seriously, put it in like a stray cat. No, you don't want to kill a cat. Put it in a pig. Put it in a pig. Eat the pig. Oh, no. She killed me. And Mary. 
given time, she will kill you. I'm okay with both of those. Yeah, I, I didn't give her a cake if she killed those two people. The dagger's right here. Regina was going to use it on me, why not you? What she did was wrong. What she did was tough love. Yes. I'm afraid because I do want a future with you. Okay, I'm gonna need you to get out of your head for a second and just do what needs to be done. Emma, your commitment issues have gone five seasons long. Stop it. Aw, it's Night of the Flame. What are you planning to do once you find Emma? Crack her head open. I'm going to show the Dark Swan what dark magic really looks like. Oh, showdown. When Regina put it back on, she enchanted my wrist and my cold cut it off. Oh, okay, there you go. I was gonna say, cut your hand off again. Yeah. If her wrist is enchanted, just cut her whole arm off. You looking good for having just dropped a baby. She knew I'm the only one who could do what has to be done. Bros! Mm -hmm. Mary Margaret, um, shut up. Yes, but back in Camelot, you helped me admit some things about myself. Gay. Why does she even have to walk out of the house? She has magic. Just poof yourself down to the pub, you'll be fine. <laughs> or maybe go see your baby. <laughs> well, she is a dark one. Is she gonna hide it behind a painting? <laughs> No, don't throw it at her. You only need a little bit, you just wasted all of it. She posed, but she froze. I see you found the squid ink, Captain. Go to your baby, Zelina! Whatever you think you're doing. No! Oh gosh! Oh! Gotcha! She took your heart, right? Don't it join them end to end! He's bleeding! Oh no! I remember seeing one of the, the pictures from the set with him on the ground, too. No. Whip his heart out. Emma, let him go. Seems like he should be bleeding a lot more. Your neck looks nasty. Oh, no. What's happening? Turn into the Slenderman. I don't like it. What is she doing again? See, I, this is totally confusing. I don't understand. This is what... Because I remember when we were in Canada, everyone was texting all the cast and like asking what was happening and they're like I don't know <laughs> well this makes no sense nope cause it wasn't the dark it was power that Merlin had over him not dark one power right well either way he he's gone it'll sort itself out later what this is dumb mm -hmm. oh and now she turned into like Lady Gaga this is really stupid by the way Have they just given up making sense on this show? Um, I'm checked out. Done now. And why wasn't he evil all this time? Well? Why isn't he realize he had power? Are you finding the truth hard to swallow? So am I. And how does Zelina know all this crap? Why are you standing like that, Emma? Oh yeah, you're yeah, frozen. frozen. Frozen pose. So much for our future, Swan. Huh. <laughs> Worst breakup ever. Are you ready to learn what else happened? If there's more, I'm done. I've never welcomed the end of an episode so much. I was like, can the credits roll now? What was funny was I wanted to tell you so bad. Oh my gosh, they just totally mimicked a plot device from iZombie. Because she saved, she saved her brother. Her, her, no, her, her boyfriend, boyfriend. Oh. by zombifying him and he hated her for it. Oh my gosh. And that's why I went... <laughs> really? And then they have to have Whale be there and make total jokes that only people from my zombie are gonna get. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna make this quick. No, we're not. We never do. So, Charming rolls up and he points a gun at Arthur and Arthur gets found out and he cuts a hole in his tent that he didn't even pay for and then runs out the back. Hook follows him. They're fighting. He's about to get hit with a sword. Emma shows up and she's like, don't hit my boot with a sword. And then, what else happens? <laughs> It was funny seeing Arthur's face first time he saw the sword put together. He about peed his pants. I know. That's, I noticed something. When when Rumpy's the dark one, his voice goes higher. Now that she's the dark one, she's got to drop it down. Drop it down. Hook's like, tell me what's going on. She's like, no. And that was basically what happened. Through the whole Through the whole episode. episode. <laughs> um, Emma gets back to Granny's. Didn't even immediately ask, hey, when Marlon disappeared when we were walking, did he show up here? She's just like, hey, I got an Ember party. Uh, so they're like, yay, we can fix things. And then Merlin shows up and freezes them and is like, hey, okay, so here's what happened. Um, I am, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you because I'm tied to a sword, so give me the ember or we're going to kill your family. And the dagger because they're going to go. They're going to touch the ends well, and somehow it will forge into a sword. <laughs> Stupid. So Hook's all mad. He's yelling at Arthur in the present time. They're like, dude, chill. He don't know nothing. 
So he goes to Rumpel and he's like, I need help. And Rumpel's like, dude, I'm not the dark one. Plus, she stole my squid ink that I was going to control her with. And my super secret hiding place that I've shown everyone in the show. <laughs> Literally everyone in the show knows where it's at. Stop hiding things there. So, um, when he's talking to Rumpel, Rumpel's like, hey, I've seen that look in her eyes. She wants to fix things. She done broke things. And she wants to make up for them. Find out what she done bit broke. Well, find out what she done broke and then you can maybe <laughs> don't fix it. So Hook's wandering the streets just calling out for Emma, which is desperate. Then back in Camelot, Emma's trying to turn the little thing into a fire. And Henry's like, hey, I'm going to help you out, Mom. Um, here's a newspaper thing. Hook wants to get a house with you. That's not putting you on the spot when you're under a lot of emotional pressure already. <laughs> so then Emma's like, no, I'm going to use my darkness one more time and help save my family. And it's, it's not going to work, dude. Any plan Emma has never works. But she rolls up, and she's like, hey, give my family back. And they're like, hey, Merlin. Well, they're all around. They're, they're hooked onto trees. Yeah, they're tied on trees. And, stuff. and they're all standing around. I'm like, good job finding a nice clearing with all these trees lined up. Because <laughs> they're all showing up on the shot, which is good. Arthur's like, I'm going to have Merlin kill you. And then Selena's like, I want to screw with her first. <laughs> and then does. it cuts back to Storybrook, and Selena's reading a book. <laughs> Hansel and Gretel to the baby, and just way too into how horrific it is. And then her tum tum starts hurting. She thinks it's a kick. It's like, oh, the baby likes the story about children dying. And Something's happens. wrong. Yeah. So Lena starts crying and yelling, and then the nurse lady comes, and then Robin and Regina show up, and they're like, what's going on? And she's like full preggers all of a sudden. He's like, what the heck? And then she's like, dark magic. Maybe. Don't eat the onion rings. Don't eat the onion rings. I remember like, getting like a little bit of a you know, gas it's on your food, tummy. It's a food baby turned into a baby. <laughs> Okay, then Hook's been calling out her name. He decides to do something really desperate, so he gets up on the building, and he takes a swan, swan dive. dive. <laughs> yeah, so he, he's like, I'll just kill myself, and then she'll save me. And then he tries to jump off a building. She saves him, and he's like, hey, maybe tell me what's going on. And she's like, no, again. And he's like, well, look at all my pretty, pretty rings. I killed people for all of them, and I was very, very lucky I have the same ring size as these people. And uh, she's like, oh, it's about regrets, blah, blah, blah. And he's like, tell me what's going on. What happened is That's that? all they said over and over again. It was basically on repeat. He wants to know what's going on, and she's like, no. Yeah. So Emma takes Hook home, and she's like, I'm going to tell you things. And then she's like, look through this telescope. There's the ocean. Are you calm now? Because I got some stuff to drop on you. Uh, you wanted to live here with me in this house. And he's like, I did write that. So then she's like, I'll tell you more stuff about it later. First, kiss me. And she totally did that poison ivy thing where her lips, you know... It's like on, like on Firefly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Was, yeah. yeah. Firefly, mm. Batman. It's been, I think it's been done. It's, it's been done. The kiss of death has been no, it's done. the good night kiss. The good night kiss, mm. whatever. Anyway, he drops on his face. Now, one thing that's cool is, like, Emma wants to, you know, kill Zelina, but she's at least like, let's get the baby out of there before I kill you. That's, that's nice. That's nice. She didn't want to hurt the baby. You baby didn't do nothing. Zelina's done some stuff. So, Zelina gets wheeled into the hospital, and she's going to have a baby. And then Dr. Will shows up, and his hair is all blonde because he was just on iZombie. Yeah, and they like, even you know, mentioned it. That was funny. And then and then oh. they were like, oh, he's, you know, last time I was in here, you threw me against the wall. Can that not happen again? It's totally going to happen It's again. so funny. And then since this is a Once Upon a Time episode, book, like, Belle just runs in with a book like she always does. She's like, oh, my gosh, literature will solve this. Like, she wants the laugh of a baby for something. First cry of a baby. Yeah, whatever. Crying, yeah, baby, baby, sad, sad baby. Yeah, baby crying. <laughs> so they're they're convinced that, that the dark one's after the baby, which, I mean, that would be pretty darn dark. Yeah, she ain't after the baby. And so Zelina's like, take the cup off me so I can take care of my baby. And, and everyone's like, nah, nah. But she's just like, I got a hand, we'll take care of you. It has never been okay. Whenever wants, if someone wants to steal a baby, they're going to steal a baby. And Dr. Well even brought that up about Zelina, that she's, you know. Last time we were in here, a baby got stolen. You stole. try to steal the baby. <laughs> Might be payback. <laughs> Then back in time, when they're all around the trees, Zelina's like, give me the ember, and Emma's like, here. And it essentially was one of those, like, popcorn things that you open, and a snake comes out, and you're like, gotcha, but this one ties you to a tree. And then and then Arthur's like, hey, um, she's being a jerk, can you just kill her? And Merlin's like, okay, but he just knocks her down. And then Arthur's like, well, kill her mom, because she has it coming. And then he starts, like, going like this, and the, the tree goes around her neck. It feels very evil dead. there's other ways to kill people, but... Yeah, like, you don't have to be dramatic about it. Just, you know what you can do? Just be like, you're dead now. I'm Merlin, exactly. so you're dead. Exactly. Wouldn't that just be... Yeah. Make it easy. It's not a Bond movie. Emma's like, no, don't be bad, Merlin. And somehow that, fight it, that fight really it. lame pep talk worked. So he fought it. And then, I mean, like, it didn't dawn on anyone, maybe we shouldn't handcuff the guy that doesn't have a hand. <laughs> because... 
He's just like finally just then remembers. Oh my! I don't even have a I hand. I don't have a hand. I can pop this. Oh sucker off. shoot! And then he goes and like fights with him, and Arthur nicks him a little on the neck. But they end up like beating up Arthur and taking the sword. I think he ran like a little girl and took a Selena with him. Yeah. Yeah. And then they no one stopped that. But then Emma's like, I'm going to fix your neck. And then she fixes his neck. And it's beautiful. And they're happy. And they have the pieces. Yay. They can do the thing. Yay. They can do the thing. Then they're all back at Granny's because that's where they just hang out no matter what land they're in. But Regina walks in and she's like, where's Emma? And they're like, she needed alone time. And Merlin's taking a nap because he's tired. And so Emma's outside trying to light the thing. And she's like, oh, I must not be able to light it because I don't want to let go of the darkness. And then Regina's like, she wanted alone time, right? I'm going to go screw with that. <laughs> so she rolls up. And then she's like, hey, I got the dagger. Tell me why you're so afraid and a sissy. And basically, Regina's like, cry for me. Tear down the walls, girl. And then they all run out. And they're like, you're being super mean, yeah, all right? It was, it was she almost, it was a breakthrough. You don't go walk into someone's therapy session right before they have a breakthrough and be like, okay, this is enough. This is enough. That's not your business. As your friend. She even said it. Yeah, friend. Regina's like, we're bros. I'm being a bro right now. And then they totally, like, you don't break a bro talking to another bro. That's bro code. So, um, Zelina makes a baby come out. Regina's like, I gotta go meet the baby, I guess. She it's walks inside. Girl. It's a girl. Yay, yay, yay. But then Emma shows up and just throws Dr. Will into the wall. He wasn't even doing anything. He deserves He's it. He's the one that, like, literally is not even invested in what's going on and poses no threat. But she's like, I hate your hair. Throws me against the wall. Copycat. <laughs> uh, everyone's like, we're gonna protect the baby. And Emma's like, you guys are idiots. I don't want the baby. And then she disappears with Selena. What? I've given birth. You don't be taking a woman off the table and yeah, go. Yeah, her insides will just fall out. <laughs> Hook is in the basement. He wakes up. He's chained up. And he sees Zelina's there. And that girl should be in a lot of pain still. But she's just like, no, I look fresh. My makeup's still dying. And then they're like, well, what's going on? And Emma walks in. She's like, okay, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to take my darkness, put it in Zelina, and then kill the crap out of her. And that way everyone's happy. And they're like, dude, you've been dark too long. That's messed up. And then after Emma, like, scurried away back in Camelot after Regina was, like, trying to be a bro, um, Hook goes and sees her, and he's like, hey, what's going on? And she's like, hey, I found this newspaper thing. Henry gave it to me. And he's like, oh, my surprise is ruined. And she's like, yeah, I'm not into commitment right now. I like you as a friend. No. She even brings <laughs> Neil up. She brings Neil up. But it's like, that's, like, the first thing you don't do when you're talking to a yeah. new boyfriend. So she's like, oh, my commitment issues are just, like, skyrocketing. And he's like, okay. Um, all right, that's really rude because I love you and what, what? And she's like, no, it's, the thing is, the reason I'm so afraid is because I don't do. want to be with you. I do, but, okay, here, and he's like, oh my gosh, shut up. I mean, at that point, you just leave. You're like, this is a ball of issues. I'm done. <laughs> but she does finally admit that she does want to be with them, and as soon as you, you know that, it's because when they kiss, the little fire comes The fire in shows up. So she's good now. She's good. And then back in Storybrooke. Uh, Charming Snow and Regina are all walking up to Emma's place. And Regina's like, I'm going to go in there and bust some heads and get some answers. I'm going to fix the situation. And, and Snow's like, oh, no. Don't hurt my little girl. And it's like, Snow, shut up. Snow, oh, Snow always shut up. And inside, uh, Zelina's like, I want the cuff off. And Hook's like, you know, I got my little hooky is enchanted to plot hearts so I can take your cuff off. Seems awfully convenient, but it works. There and then go. she's like, all right, I'm going to get in a really good outfit. And then I'm going to release you. Let's go. And Wait. she surprises us. Yeah, I know. The one time you trust her, you're, it, it kind of pays off. Kind of. <laughs> so Emma walks outside. And she's like, guys, you're, you're yelling really loud in my front yard. I heard you. <laughs> and um, they're like, we're going to fight you. And then Snow's like, we're going to fight you a little bit, but save you. And then they're like, you're not even Emma. And she's like, yeah, I am. And then she like pokes a sword in the ground and it does something. I don't know. It makes it really bright outside. They had sparklies on their face. They had face sparklies, yeah. yeah. And then while well, it's all bright outside from the sparkly sword action, Zelina and Hook come out of the basement. Zelina's like, let's go. And Hook's like, no, I'm going to look for the squid ink and try and stop her. And Zelina's like, I'm going to go. This, I'm done I'm here. I'm done. I got she, my shop and I'm out of here. She just said she wants to kill me. I'm going to leave. <laughs> I can't do it. No, I mean, Mom makes a good point. Like... Selena she, walks outside and comes back with, well, like, a... she goes through a door. She it comes back be. with a dream catcher. You know she probably just, like, she, walked in the dark garage. She's like, oh, what is this? Dream catchers. Oh, I'm seeing memory. Oh, I've watched, I've watched. And she sees everybody's memories. It's like, and she's oh, like, oh, I can I'll, use this. I'll use this. Forget my newborn baby. I'll deal with her later. <laughs> oh, Baby's probably hungry. So we don't, I don't, we don't really know what's going on outside. All we know is Emma walks back inside. And Hook's digging through the house to try and find the squid ink. He moves a picture because that's what that's the dark one style. 
And behind the picture is the squid ink. So he like pops it and throws it on her. He did not That's why it. she posed like she was like she's like oh wait. I'm gonna freeze. I'm no, gonna look she, good. She she, she knew she's like oh I'm gonna freeze. Now I'm ready to freeze. <laughs> it just gets so stupid from here on out. It does. So, so Hook's like, okay, tell me what happened. You're a villain. What freaking happened in Camelot? And just then, Zelina rolls in and she's like, it's like the end of a Bond movie when they tell their master plan. Mm -hmm. She comes in and like, she just knows everything and it's like, here, watch this. And she has Dreamcatcher with his memory yeah, on it. Yeah, she ran into all of those she, on the way out and got flashes of truth. She's just like, what, what, what? Oh, I remember things now oh. a little bit. Seriously, she's just rooting around in her garage. <laughs> Is more, you had a baby. She didn't know where the light was. Where's the light she, switch? She's like, ah, she's right. ah. <laughs> and it all made sense with like, I, I'm too evil I, not to use this. Crap. I need to go in and see what happens. <laughs> and what did her mouth freak? Yeah, that's really funny. <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> Emma's just... like, my body's frozen, but I'm gonna do it over there. What's her mouth frozen? My mouth is frozen. It's like, well, back when Rumple got frozen with squid ink, his face still worked. <laughs> So Zelina rolls in and she's like, hey, I want to hurt the dark one. And she stabs Hook right in the chest. And it then freaked she... me out when I first saw it. Yeah, mom saw this episode before me because I was That's in Canada. <laughs> so then she's like, hey, what's the deal? You notice your heart doesn't hurt because you're not dead? She takes such glee in She's that. got some splaining to do. <laughs> so Zelina's like, look at this dream catcher. It'll tell you what happened. And then it goes like flashback to Camelot. They're getting ready to join the sword and the dagger and as she's starting to do it, Hook's neck starts bleeding because it was like Excalibur is like they, that was they did the same thing with the librarian because Excalibur's like wounds are like they don't ever heal. It's so then, a thing. then it just gets convoluted. I don't even then know I, how to recap this because it makes I, no I, sense. Why did it start bleeding then? Yeah, because because first of all, the cut on his neck wasn't even that bad. Well, it's supposed to be they won't it'll heal. Get, it'll never heal. But like he also wasn't artery cut before. Mm -hmm. It was just like a little scratch. But for some reason, when she starts to join the swords, it somehow undoes the magic she did to fix his neck and they're all like just let him die we gotta move on with our lives and she's like guys seriously everyone's love like I'm, okay i'm not even like a huge emma fan but like everyone's love comes before hers <laughs> like they're like oh true love with the charmings oh true love with regina oh true love with these people and then they're like emma just get over it get a new boyfriend <laughs> but um and then she what, she says something that doesn't make a whole lot of sense what was it? it was like it was like we can try and tether him to the sword and help him mm -hmm. but they're like that will make two dark ones which i'm like how i don't understand but then she's like i because gotta fix this and she like poofs them both to that little field with all those roses that grow directly out of the ground yeah. anyway merlin though he said if she joins it it'll be a steep price it'll kind of be like what knocks her into being dark one i'm not sure how trying to save someone would make her the dark one but uh it no. happens yeah so out in the field, they have this touching, I don't want you to die. And he's like, it's so cool. It's it's okay. Just let me die. And she's like, no, but don't. And then it looks like he dies. And then she pulls out Excalibur. And then it just gets weird again. Because back in the diner, Merlin starts getting these tendrils like the Slenderman, which like, is creepy. The black, like he's like, got evil inside of him. Yeah, like evil. and then But then it does something to Hook as well. So she does it. And then he like disappears out of the, the field. And she's immediately just transformed into that, like, a... Uh, Had her hair did and everything. She looked like David Bowie. Like, immediately. She didn't even have to go anywhere. And she's just hair did, new wardrobe, <laughs> eyebrows all on fleek, you know what I mean? <laughs> Again, seriously, I kept waiting for the credits to roll. I'm like, can we be done now? This is getting stupid. And then more stuff happens. So then it shows the little, like, dark one sewer manhole cover. <laughs> Has a bunch of the black stuff come out, and it's in the shape of Killian... <laughs> With a robe on, with a hood, yeah, and Excalibur that. says Killian on it now. Okay. Back in, like, Emma's house, Hook's like, this has got to be another explanation. And Zelina's like, pick up the sword. And she does this thing, and she's like, it's a glamour spell to cover your name. And it's like, Zelina, how do you know all this crap? I'm going to say it again. Get to your baby. <laughs> Th this drama is not that exciting. Your baby <laughs> needs its mother. So then he's like, I was never in danger. You saved me a bunch just so I wouldn't know. And she's like, I'm doing everything for you. And he's like, no, nah, you're bad. I don't love you no more. And it's like, why are you laughing? <laughs> and Zelina's just giggling Zelina's away. having a great time. And then Zelina's like, but wait, there's more. You want to know what else? And he's like, yeah, sure. But I want to take care of her and let's save it for the next episode. And then it goes to credits. So it's like... It's, why, okay, why wasn't he bad? And all why, the time. All the time. And why didn't he know he had powers? Does he have powers? He's a dark one. 
I have no idea. It didn't make any sense to me. I, I don't. I was confused, and you weren't ever me to talk to you about it. What do you guys think? I'm still too behind, so I'm not going to read the comments until I get them all up. But, uh, or just don't put spoilers. Don't be jerks about it. Don't forget to do the things. Rate, comment, subscribe. If you guys want to talk about it, put a comment. And, Mommy. Yes? Say goodbye. Goodbye, Mommy. No. Bye. See you guys later. Until next time. <laughs>